Hey guys, my name is Ismos, and today we are doing yet another cinematic render in Blender, and this is what we are going to be doing here. But before we get into that, it has come to my attention that some of you have money. You are rich, richer than me indeed. So in my ploy to enrich myself with some of your money, I have made yet another add-on. This is the only add-on you will ever need in your life. It's going to change everything about your life. You don't have a girlfriend. This is the add-on for you. Just throw money at me and your life is, is going to improve significantly. You're struggling in bed? <laughs> this is the add-on for you. Maybe that's a bit an exaggeration, but if that's what gets you to buy this add-on, yes, it does that too. So your problems are solved. Other than those other things that it does, there is also the things it does within Blender. So uh, let me show you here in this render. You can see this wall here uh, is textured, but it still looks a bit plain and uh, if we go to the shader nodes of that particular uh, shader that uh, this texture here you can see we have quite a lot of nodes if you wanted to add more details uh, to make the wall look something like this we and uh, we were using nodes we would have to be adding extra nodes on top of this which is going to become a mess but why do that when you can easily use a uh, plain surfaces and uh, you still get results that look similar identical or even much better with more control so this add-on is very 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 simple and uh, just give Giving you the core functionality of what you're trying to do so for example if I wanted to add extra details I uh, may be on the floor everything renders quite nicely you can see from the render preview uh, from the render I made already that uh, you can see those details how they come out here without those details uh, the walls would look a bit too plain let me show you how it works so if, let's say I wanted to add uh, this extra detail here I just load that in and uh, let's say I want to add it yeah, to this wall which is which looks a bit too plain so i can just add it to scene just reorient it and uh, we have that so you can get this add-on on my patreon page as of now but uh, i'll be putting it up on on the blender market soon after i add in a few extra functionality like uh, changing the colors and the other thing it does if the texture you adding doesn't have an alpha mask or an alpha channel like say this one this wall here let me add that you can use the image has no alpha channel and it should create its own alpha channel for you so let me just bring this up scale it and uh, you can control the transparency using this alpha node you can, I can uh, play with the alpha mask here and basically you see this adds those small details uh, that would be very very hard you can see already the wall looks much much better than it was so if i take off this and i take off this you can see the wall looks too plain bring that back and the wall looks much much better older and uh, better basically yeah so let's go back into the time lapse 